vast, blue, and pulsing with life. The sea is the heart of our planet, pumping blood to every part of the proverbial body and connecting people everywhere. The oceans support life on Earth, not only by providing food to eat, but by regulating climate, absorbing carbon dioxide and producing oxygen. Without healthy oceans, we are doomed as a race. Below the waves, a different world exists, and the shallow reefs of the tropics make up the rainforests of the sea, forming some of the most diverse ecosystems on Earth. Taking up less than 0.1% of the oceanic surface, coral reefs are the epicenter for immense biodiversity, being home to at least a quarter of all marine species. They sustain human life too, providing food, protecting shorelines, and offering ecotourism benefits. We constantly underestimate the worth of our oceans, because if we were to compare their value to the top 10 economies globally, we'd be astounded to learn that they would rank seventh, providing an annual value of 2.5 trillion US dollars in ecosystem goods and services. Okay, so here is a spook crappy. The spook maker is from the strand. And they are very unlucky. They are going to be with these eight beings in all directions. And they are going to be very unlucky. They are going to be with the two others. So they are going to be with the men. An archipelago in the sparkling blue Indian Ocean of 115 granitic islands and coral atolls, the Seychelles is often said to echo a time when an innocent world shimmered in its first brilliance. It's a sanctuary to nature at its rawest, blindingly green forests with dazzling flora assembled in a magical mix of textures and patterns. The islands boast 2,000 different species of plants, from towering forest trees to rare orchids, including 81 endemic species found nowhere else on Earth. This is a true Eden, where unique plant adaptations like insect eating capabilities have evolved because of the geographic isolation. Here is an absolute tropical paradise. And uh, as people have known, you have to be safe to be on the strand. It is the breathtaking vegetation that provides the stage on which the Seychellois wildlife can play their roles, and the cast is diverse. It's a show made up predominantly of the smaller actors, birds, insects, amphibians, and reptiles and the Seychelles enjoys one of the highest endemism rates anywhere in the world. As in any ecosystem, the creatures that live on these, the oldest oceanic islands in the world, live in a fine balance, intricately connected in a web of interdependence, yet each with a uniqueness of their own. and survival strategies that suits them to their distinctive habitats. From a bird's eye view, the jungles appear as endless as the sea, 
But birds are not the only flying creatures here. The flying foxes, enormous fruit bats, can be seen soaring overhead during the day and at dusk. These winged wonders represent the largest mammals on the islands. In so tropische omgeving is daar lewe oor ons te. Mens moet net so'n bietjie rondkrap en dan kry jy dit soos hierdie klein varswaterkrapie. Dit het is in die rotse en a varswater bergstroom bietjie kry. The most notable land animal is the giant Aldabra tortoises that live for over a century and can weigh over 250 kilograms. Despite populations diminishing in the past, these animals are guarded protectively by the Seychelles War and now enjoy greater concentrations than any other place globally. Human life on the islands also plays out in harmony with nature and sustainability is central to ensuring this paradise remains intact. Separated by shimmering water, different islands hold different pearls, and Pralin is famous for the Valle de Mai. A dense forest of coconut palms protects the secret of this world-famous and ancient valley where the coco de mer grows, the enormous seed taking the shape of a female pelvis. Weighing up to 30 kilograms, this is the world's heaviest seed and for eons was believed to come from under the sea. Sexes occur on different trees and the pollen-rich male catkins attract all manner of reptiles and birds that feed on them. The abundance and uniqueness of wildlife and ecosystems in this tropical utopia are self-evident, so it is no wonder scientists and explorers have been and continue to be intrigued with this beautiful place and thanks to the efforts of conservationists, these natural systems continue to thrive.